My name is Agnes and I'm here for the iGemma with my game Evolve. So actually we're a small company of two women and we're still students um, of computer science in Munich. Right now we're working on Evolve, which is a tower defense game, but with genetics. So your towers uh, actually uh, reproduce themselves and their kids uh, can have the genes from their parents. So there's different types of genes you can actually pass on to your uh, offspring. So right now the game is available online um, and you can just download it for Android or play it on the web. But we'd like to make it available for iOS as well and on the long term there's still lots of room for improvement. Um, so we're working also on uh, several other games in education. So this is just one of the examples and we'd like to um, introduce natural sciences into games and actually uh, give the people um, a, uh, well, a way of thinking about um, uh, sciences, like uh, the intuition uh, behind it and just some applications on how to use it. So our game is a tower defense, which means uh, you have your base and you have to defend it against enemies. In order to do that, you buy uh, build towers. And now the clue is those towers, uh, they reproduce and they make uh, children. So those children, they uh, come from their parents. So the parents have different types of genes and they pass them on to their uh, children. So uh, there's, for example, the shape and the color which are passed on in different ways. The shape, for example, is like the blood types. There's A, B and zero, um, which corresponds to triangle, circle and square. Um, so now this doesn't tell you too much about the genes itself, but it gives you some intuition uh, about how genetics works and how they pass on um, their genes. 